Hello there. People love horror movies. Despite the fact that the world is full of scary, unpleasant, and simply creepy things, many people are willing to pay money for a ticket to the movies to be scared. Do you want to play a game? Okay. Scientists say that it's a way to deal with anxiety and also get a portion of safe adrenaline. It's obviously better to see a ghost in a movie than getting adrenaline from jumping off roofs. And of course, actors play an important role. They depict the monsters and evil spirits on the screen, but often remain unrecognized in real life. Well, today we will slightly lift the veil of mystery and look at them without any masks and makeup. Let's get it on. Bonnie Aarons Remember the frightening nun, the demon Valak from The Conjuring 2, who made goosebumps run down the back of every viewer? It's really hard to believe, but not only the makeup artists were responsible for a terrible look, but also the actress Bonnie Aarons, or rather her unusual appearance. At the very beginning of her career, Aarons attended acting school in New York City, but she was often told that she wouldn't be able to play in the movies because of her eyes and nose. They were just too unusual. As a result, Bonnie found a job in Europe, starring in short films and commercials. She appeared in The Princess Diaries, and then got a small role in several popular popular horror films like Drag Me to Hell, but none of them are comparable to The Conjuring and the effect that Bonnie managed to produce in the audience. The public liked this character so much that the creators even decided to make a spin-off about Valak. Unfortunately, The Nun didn't meet the expectations, but if you want to once again check out the frightening Bonnie Aarons and see how she perfectly plays her role, be sure to watch the movie. <laughs> 